Natalie Ambrulia has said she gives her number to women considering IVF and wants to break down weird taboos surrounding sperm donation. The torn singer, 46, welcomed her first child, a son named Max, after undergoing IVF with a sperm donor aged 44 in 2019. Speaking on the Spinning Plates podcast she told how other women thinking of doing the same seek her out for advice and often well up when she helps them. She said, I think what's important on the journey is to have support. So, if I ever meet even strangers at a dinner party and they're talking about wanting to do IVF, I give them my number and say ask me anything, because it would have been really nice to have that. And these women well up because there is some kind of weird taboo around it. I think for a lot of women it's kind of like oh can I talk to you and they come up to me like that. It's like I've become a trailblazer and I wasn't even trying to be. You wouldn't think, Terry's a taboo, until you're in that situation. I felt like I didn't know what I was going to get back at me in terms of judgment. But, in the end, I have received nothing but love, nothing but support, nothing but encouragement and that has been really reassuring. Natalie is currently believed to be single. Natalie underwent in vitro fertilization in order to fall pregnant, a medical procedure in which a woman has an already fertilized egg inserted into her womb to become pregnant. The procedure can be done using eggs and sperm from a couple or, as Natalie revealed she chose, using donors. The dual Australian slash British citizen endured a very high profile four year marriage to Daniel Johns, which ended in 2008 with Natalie revealing in 2019 that the pair no longer speak. Natalie met the silver chair frontman at an awards show in 1999 and they married four years later, on New Year's Eve, in a beachside ceremony in Queensland. Guests at the lavish affair included close pals Kylie Minogue, actor Guy Pearce and virgin boss Richard Branson. The couple were often spotted in public locked in amorous displays of affection and, as several onlookers regularly remarked, they were always giggling like teenagers. As time passed, they became the subject of increasing breakup rumors, partly due to the length of time they spent apart. She announced she was in a relationship with Matt Field in 2017, but the pair have not been pictured together since 2018. In 2015, Natalie told The Evening Standard that she would really love to be a mum. It is something that is going to happen, she added. I am still hopeful that I will meet someone. And yes, I may well look into other options if I don't. Natalie previously said she never expected to be divorced and without children in her 40s. She explained, I am a bit behind the curve as far as family is concerned, but that doesn't bother me right now. Natalie appeared as Beth Brennan, later Willis in Neighbors, in the 90s and also appeared as a judge on X Factor in 2010, 